Hi, hello, how are you doing today? I am just reshoving the plastiline into my uh, headphone and we are almost ready to go. Guys, I have realized something amazing. In an install this light, I can actually use QuickSafe. I will probably forget how to do it since I haven't done it in forever, but where is it? I even set it to the most useless buttons I could do, the one that gets smaller and smaller. So, um, where do I want it? Here? Okay, I just have to remember to remove them later so that I don't actually use that on my main playthrough because it's, it's known to confuse something in Skyrim and break things, you know. But we can roll with it for now. All right, so where are we? You, are you staring at me again? Yeah. Just don't. Quiet. Let's see what we've got here. Ingredients. I don't know if we'll be able to do any alchemy here, to be honest with you. But this definitely, definitely looks useful, so let's take them. Some of it is stealing, some of it is not. So... Actually, I think food actually gives you stuff in Skyrim. Yeah, it does. I'm used to it being completely useless. What's this? I can just take it. No, I cannot take that. Well, I mean... Saria has always been a thief, so she's not suddenly going to change. What is this? Some kind of a chess piece? This is not a figurine. It looks like a chess piece of kind of, of a sort warrior. Maybe we will need it later. Let's keep it. I do not need ABCs for barbarians. Thank you very much. Ah, uh, we can leave it be. <laughs> we know how to read. We have a whole library going. Okay, so if we need to be hard to detect, I need to remember that this isn't uh, this isn't actually our old skill set, so we are not good at sneaking. Okay. Need something? Anything else here that would help us? Be careful. Well, he's... Hi. Yeah, I guess he doesn't have a tongue, does he? Silver sword. Well, that would be useful, possibly, potentially, but he's looking at us, so... Whoa, what is this? This is so pretty. Tell you, those, those things would so be going into my house if I had one. And now I'm going to regret it. Scroll of Heal Other. Mm, roll of Paper Might. Not needed. Spell Tongue Flames. I don't have my mod that makes books glow. So it doesn't look as tempting as normally. I have to actually check things out. I am not told. This is so expensive. I think we will need this. I'm going to take this. It looks like something we might potentially definitely need. <sighs> Want in my main game? Damn it. Uh, all right, all right, all right. I have to stop being obsessed by furniture. I uh, Sky Sims is is just in my blood, I think. Bows to 5% more damage from dumplings? Well, okay. This is so weird to me. Oh, no, what a, so beautiful. What are those things? Summon jumper. Summon's jumper in Tamriel Wilderness to act as your steed? I mean, I'm starting to really regret not um, <laughs> not playing this on my main save, but I know I shouldn't. I know I shouldn't. It is not rectified. Stop. 
obsessing over beautiful things. Let's let's check them out. Sealed melody of alteration. What does it actually do? Can I unseal it? Cannot equip this item. Well, I would guess I can unseal it. I've read it. We need this. I think it's just history. I am not a history buff. I am very sorry. Oh, actually, if you are actually curious what this book says, here we go. Since, I don't know, it might be from this mod. And if you want to read it, then you can just pause the video and read it. Spider. It's another piece. One-handed weapons, that could come in handy. Sphere. Um, I'm just saying, this mod would go absolutely great with the legacy of the Dragonborn. <laughs> if it was incorporated, it would absolutely be in the Hamster Edition. Shanath, I urge you, when again you visit the archive, seek out Mara's Tear and Fellowship of the Temple forever, Marisa. And that doesn't seem like something that has a lot of value, per se, but you never know might be able to use that. I should stop picking up all the ingredients. I'm not going to be doing alchemy. Stuff of courage. I don't think we need it, but... I don't know, maybe we can sell it, actually. What do we have here? Master Suri Yasuyama. Stamina regenerates slower. It doesn't seem like something we would exactly want to use. Uh, oh, more of those. What, what do they do? This is so strong! Or are potions normally like that here? I don't know. What I would like to have is a torch. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We, we have spells for that. I forgot. Right, that's much better. Now we may be seen by something, but at least I can see things. Anything I am missing? I don't think so. I can probably stop skulking about this in there I think it's gems oh my goodness it's gems what am I going to do with gems in this playthrough I don't know but it, it, it's gems okay um, so we should be able to I'm so sorry dude what do you have to he's got raw meat to eat that is awful we got an apple and gold cheese and bread, I guess. If it wasn't just on the ground, might have been better. Okay, this is mine now. And let's quickly assign it because we might might need it. So, you know what? It's better than nothing. Because we found some ghosts or whatever. I have to stop. I have to control myself. I'm not doing alchemy. And I have nothing to decorate. Wow. Okay. Okay, what the hell? This is beautiful. Look at this. No, seriously, this is just, I think this is the most beautiful location I have ever seen in Skyrim, so I'm just sitting here uh, quite speechless for, for a second. Look at this. After I'm done with this episode, I'm coming back here and I'm taking screenshots. That is just happening. Who are you? 
What? Let me treat you. Oh, really? Ah, uh, you can. Do you want a dumpling? What? What? What would a crab like? Maybe. Maybe something with chicken. Oh, that's actually pretty useful. About some cheese. Septim added. The crab pays me for food. All right then, if you say so. Mm. Holy hell, guys! Look at this. I, I just, I'm just a little bit stumped about. those lights coming from <laughs> I want to go there in real life come on Speak quickly. I, I'm all ears. Hi. Tell me a little about this place. It's the town house. was found in the waning years of the Third Era. I was part of an expedition that studied the Dwemer cities of Skyrim. We found the entrance to Bahalzar out of sheer luck. We wanted to stay a while, then the Oblivion Crisis broke out. And after that, the Red Year. Returning to Morrowind was no longer an option, so we found our own settlement here. Until next time. Do we even want to escape this place? <laughs> That's the best question here and the most important one. Do we even care that we are kept in here we are allowed to run around this place talk to people give crabs treats why bother escaping <laughs> what is it that awaits us outside I mean I would miss sky and sun but <laughs> it's just so much prettier than Skyrim like this compared to frozen wastes and tundra and tundra spiders roaming around the tundra, I mean, seriously, seriously, what kind of choice is that? Natchez! Natchez! My favorite! Hey! Hi! How you doing? I have half a mind to actually run my game in 4K and just take screenshots here. To be perfectly honest with you, which I might do. Of course it's not playable then, but just run around and screenshot the hell out of this place. Okay, I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just I'm just looking at the shiny right now. I'm so sorry. I am easily impressed by things that are glowing. If you have been watching my other Let's Plays, you would know that already. And you wouldn't be surprised. You would probably see, oh, this is shiny. Let me fast forward 10 minutes <laughs> before something starts happening. What is this? Is this a plant? Ugh, chorus eggs. Ugh, yeah, I want that out of there. That is not pretty. What? This is alive. This is a slug. Mine it? That sounds cruel. Shell bug. I don't have a pickaxe, but I don't know if I would want to. I mean, it is 
kinda gross, but at the same time it seems harmless. Talent sprout. Do I want to activate it? I can quick save and check. Did I do anything? I'm not actually sure. Maybe maybe I need something to activate it with. I have no idea what that would be doing. This is like like a plant but not quite. Maybe it's some sort of an organic shell with a plant inside it, I don't know. If it's something from the actual lore of Elder Scrolls, well, I'm sorry, I know nothing about it. We have a map of this place? Yeah, we do. Oh, this is the this is the damn orc's house. This is where. Well, they wouldn't say where we where we live because we certainly don't live there. Well, kinda do, but it's not a home. That, that's what I mean to say. I wouldn't call this a home. What is this this glowing thing here? Tell me. Guys, that's the problem. I, I really don't know if I want to get out of here. Like, I've lost my motivation for escaping. <laughs> We're just fine. We can just chill here for a, for a decade or two. Hi. Sarah, Rajira wishes to speak with you. Ah, but the slaves here, they can't speak. Are you like me? It is true, but Rajira is an unusual guest. Unusual and rare. Rajira was lucky enough to keep his dog intact. Right, there are slaves in this place. These people are evil. This is why we want to escape. Do not get blinded by the shiny. Do not. Aren't you afraid that I can reveal your secret to others? But did he say? He didn't say he was, it was a secret, did he? No one will trust you anyway. Rajira lives here for 15 years. Alright then, what do you want from me? Rajira is a trader. He sells information. Rajira would like to offer you his service. And what can Rajira tell me? Rajira sees many things. Things no one talks about. About local citizens. About Sadrit Kegra. For pity, 20 coins. Rajira will tell you something ah, of interest. Alright. I see what the Krabbies are for now. But you know what, Rajira? You should probably not talk to me right in the middle of the town by the glowy thing. <laughs> just saying. Just saying. I, I am afraid I don't have enough money with me. They've taken all of my money away. It is fine, Mutsera. Rajira will wait for the moment. You have 20 coins. When you would talk to Rajira again, make sure no one would overhear you. Yes, I will actually do that. Thank you, Rajira. So, I think we need to uh, gather some food. Let me treat you. I'll just give them all of this. Will you give me two? Oh, he gives me random stuff! Oh, <laughs> that is so cute. I don't know why it's cute, it's just, it just is. Don't ask. Peril. He just gave me one thing. Hey, you're, you're being slightly adorable over there. Have an apple. <gasps> he didn't like it. Hi. Would you like some fish? I'm not sure he would. So they like dumplings, right? How about some tomatoes? He quite likes it. Um, how about if I give you three? He didn't like tomatoes. Uh, Picky crabs. <laughs> How about a honeycomb? 
No? Oh, come on. There's honey on it. Here, we like this one. Hi, Nachi. <laughs> they are just twirling around. I don't know, maybe Skyrim Madcrafts also twirl around? I know they go underground, it's probably the same animation, but it, it's just kind of cuter when they are not hostile and they have a giant lesion growing on top of him. Well, that's not exactly cute um, in my book, but uh, attitude makes up for it, you know? It just makes up for it. Okay, so I think we should we should acquire some food. How much How much gold do we have? We have free gold. I'm not sure if anyone would buy our stolen stuff. <laughs> or the stuff that we haven't so much stolen as hold out of our master's house. Let's see what, what else we can find here. Since this is an adventure exploration kind of mod, I think the episodes might be a little longer than usual because I, I have a feeling from what I see it's going to be a lot of fumbling around, trying to find find our way through this bizarre town. Maybe we can sell those. We will make an attempt to sell sell the plants. Uh, gross. Do you like the plants? No, I'm sorry. I won't give you my tea. I might need it for survival. I don't know if there is combat in this mod, I have no idea. What is this um, Tamina's alchemy shop? And it's closed. Yes, I'm playing without compass because I have figured that since they have captured us they would have taken away any compass we might have had. And I could say that he gave it back but... I don't know, it, it just seems more immersive, plus this is it's just too beautiful to clutter it with <laughs> uh, UI with elements, I don't care. Um. Is it actually worth something? Does the valve do anything? No, it, oh, that, there's something inside here. I don't think we can do anything about it. Hi! Who are you? I'm waiting. Don't bother me with your mud crap, what? How long have you lived here? In Sadrith Kegran. Since my husband dragged me on an expedition with those Telvani sorcerers. Though, it is a pleasure living here now. I'll take my leave then. And you? This had better be good. Uh, what are these strange plants everywhere? At the center of town, oh, she's the where alchemist. the council hall is located, you can see Tel And, the prime mushroom. Its magic not only elongates our lives drastically, but also makes the plants mutate wonderfully. Some of them I brought from Blackreach, while others have grown themselves. Can I offer my? I don't know if I want to offer my. I'd best get going. I don't know her. I don't know what we are doing here, and Tamina, I don't want to offer them anything right now. Uh, well, wrong move, and we could lose our tongue. You know, we have to be more careful than that. Are we actually in a cave or just going around? I think we're just going around. But now I sit here thinking, imagine you have allergies in this place. If this is all pollen, I I would feel so sorry for the person. They actually, they, they were talking about some amulet being lost. Galsa, remind me please how much you paid for your Khajiit. Let me think. It was 900 septums, I remember it well. Snatched it just before Dalos. Oh, how he was skulking. It was hilarious. Huh, pretty 
expensive. So how does she manage so far? She's acting weird at times. Staring there, staring blankly at one point, as if she's lost. I'm all ears. I hope she doesn't regain her consciousness one day. Go off on a killing spree of everyone here. What? Has that happened before? What? No. I mean, Dobby, I'm just kidding. Well, yeah. They this are one needs something. Human beings, you know. Well, they were now? they were talking about some amulet. Maybe Mistress they would just. Elenil, I have a question for an educated herbalist such as yourself. I've read about Crimson Nernrood in a book. They're rumored to be found in Skyrim, but I've never encountered the plant. It's true. Such a speed. This one yeah. Needs city of the I have a question. As well. I have read about it. Ooh, uh, can I offer my assistance with anything? You said some crap. Got your dangerous. amulet or something? What can you help me with? I don't know. As a matter of fact, I so have many. got a task Romans for you. Have you heard of Telvanni Bugmusk? It's a very rare and, and expensive perfume. Highly prized throughout the Empire. Ah, Even a barbarian would be drawn to its fragrance. The idea of making it hit me recently. That's why I was in need of the scent glands of the Grayson Bugs. By some miracles, Shaglak managed to get some for me. I'd like you to collect oh, my order from him. The glands have been paid for. Will you help me? Mm, Alright, I'll do it. Thank this. you. I might even reward you with a sample of the perfume. You look so scowling. Smile. I'm a slave. I'm gonna scowl. Dobby, would you mind if I come over to yours? She seems to be kind of living in a different world. But she said thank you, so she's got that going for her, I suppose. What is this place? Lofangic requires a key. Ah, we have to go to the damn orc. This can we go council hall? Well, let's see. Let's see. I, I'm not sure this is where we su we are supposed to be going, but sure. Recovering an order doesn't seem like something that could piss anyone off, so we might as well. Oh, this is all stealing, isn't it? Whoops! Uh, this is not the spell I meant to cast. I much prefer travel lanterns, this glowing orb is really annoying. Um, I can actually take those. Don't mind if I do in that case. Mm, I want the dumpling. And those books look kind of useful too. I'm just going to go sit somewhere and read it, you know. Yeah, yeah go away. We might need those for future reference, so I would rather have them with me. Maybe they will tell us something about slavery that we could use to escape it. Ah, go away. Do you have a better place to be? <gasps> so many potions. And ingredients, my goodness. Oh, this is such a pain that I don't need any of this and there is really no point in picking it up. Oh, the potions though. Nut jelly is just I, I have to. Okay. Um So if we need it, stuff like this, we can get it from here. That is good to know. Um these are not filled soul gems. Oh, 
We can go fight people right now. We have so many potions. Oh, the chess pieces? Oh! Aww. That's nice. I love it. Okay, now I, 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 I absolutely have to... I don't know if I'll find any use for them, but... It's soul gems. Okay. Now let's be reasonable and see what else we can do here. Oh, this is Razira. Oh, we don't have the money for you. But it's good to know that we can find him here. There is a chest in there. Oh, it requires key. Morakton Agency. Speak. I own God all day. So here is the front. Probably some council meetings being held here. It really reminds me this whole place of Underdark from Dungeons and Dragons. I mean, it's uh, it's Dark Elves, so that's probably some kind of. I wonder which one was first, actually. For me, it was always Dungeons and Dragons. So everything Dark Elf related from other franchises franchises like the Elder Scrolls always always was a copycat action but to be fair I don't actually know it is possible that these Dark Elves were first I don't know when the first Elder Scrolls came out okay I'm going to take these uh, Marisa, I cannot work with this madman any longer. Shanath is going crazy and is on the verge of doing something irreparable. Henceforth, the passage to the planetarium is closed until you convince Shanath no one will get inside. I warn you for the last time, Yen Ilu. What is he up to? Marisa, Enwa from the last auction behave excessively sternly. Tell Shaglak to be more selective in choosing next time. Yeah, your amulet's not, not that great, huh? Elven dagger, a letter. Marisa, for the development of our farm and for a greater variety in the city, we need seedlings of Nernrut. We would be grateful if Shaglak could bring some from his next travel. Sincerely, Sylvani. So they... It would appear that... Shaglak basically goes outside and brings them stuff. I wonder if the crabs like Shin. Kinda doubt it? Although, they did like the tea, so maybe they do like Shin. Oh, there's more of those. Melody of Illusion, Melody of Destruction. And a note from Erver to Marisa again. Marisa, I have finally completed the writing of the second volume of the history of Sadrith Kegran. Is there anything you wish to add, Erver? This one is probably not the most useful note we will ever find. Um, well, no, I will not give mud crab's legs to the crabs. That seems like wrong thing to do so we can take the warrior let's who sees me go away let's take all of those things daedra heart actually i want to see what what the crabs like because they might like various things and we need a whole bunch i think they will like honey treat Will they like this? Uh, apprentice, there's, we don't have any lockpicks. If we did, that would make it easier to explore these parts. So this is just some cages. Is there anything inside it? Uh, just plate. Nothing in, in the hay, no. Okay, so I think I think we should go talk to the crabs, so to speak, and see if we can uh, give them some more stuff. We need 20 gold to, to find something out from the Khajiit. Okay, crabby. What would you like? A bread. Um, honey nut treat. Charcoal and a spoon? 
<laughs> really? It's like, like like a bad Santa there. <laughs> there is a bad Santa. Uh, well, I mean, a bad Santa joke in there as well. Flynn, yeah, I thought they might like it. What will you give me for f nothing? You're not getting any f anything more from me. Hi. Um, maybe you will be better. Shin Suyama. Oh, another spoon. Uh, wine, soup. <sighs> the bad Santas. Okay, must stay free of them. Romit, I will give him everything and see what happens. He gives me more stuff. Empty wine bottle. We have seven gold. That is not a lot of gold. <laughs> Hi. Oh, she's a Nenua. She doesn't have a tongue. As beautiful as this place is, all of those elves should die. Because they are absolute assholes. Abandoned tower. Well, that sounds like something worth checking out. What have we here? Wonder if the crabs would like it. Clay? Well, those are things we could in theory sell, but I don't think slaves get to sell things, do they? Okay, so can I go up there somewhere? Or is that not a thing? What is this? Um, I do not think we can go up. I don't think there is really anything in here. But when has there ever been an abandoned tower where there is nothing in it? I'm not buying it. There must be something. Oh, maybe not here, but maybe not now. But there must be something in there. Ooh, what is this place? I don't know, but we are going down. What? It's a chest, but we still don't have lockpicks. Damn it! Oh, we can't go down there actually, so we can only go to the chest. There's probably something good in it. what the map would tell us. Mycelium, something about shrooms, right? Abandoned tower, Chitin and Flynn. Is that a tavern? And if so, can I enter it? Yeah, well, at least we can enter it. I don't know if it's a tavern. And of course it's gorgeous. Well, uh, the walls I'm not the biggest fan of, but <laughs> you know, it, it, it makes a great impression. Maybe that's the, the way to say it. Oh, another poor thing. I want to free all of them. I want to free them and I want to bring them back to Skyrim and free of this tyranny. I'm actually curious what would happen if I tried to kill somebody. They said I wouldn't be able to. But, you know, for science we, we absolutely have to check. So I'm going to quick save it. And then we're going to try to kill him. Hey! 
Now you die! Just a scratch! You are in theory able to kill people, maybe. Ah, uh, I just lost. I wasn't really trying, but they said I was. I was curious if it would let me attack. I, I wasn't really. I didn't really care to fight it properly. Because the amulet. I mean, when he gave us the amulet, he said we wouldn't be able to attack him. I remember in the Mad Forgotten City, whenever you commit a crime. I have said before that it's probably my favorite Skyrim mod I have ever played. So, whenever you commit a crime everything basically goes to shit so if you steal something even if nobody sees you i think if you steal something if you attack somebody everything goes to shit and it's it's really cool i will definitely be uh, making a showcase of that mod at some point it's actually active in the main playthrough so it's going to come there what did i pick up that i did not want to uh not this i would want to get rid of this can you not look at me? There is something I want here. I want this letter. Because there might be something important in it. And I would also like those sheens and stuff to give to the crabs, so... Can you go clean somewhere else, please? Please? No, oh, go away. Come on, go away. This is it. It's honeycombs. We need them. Please, kindly. There's... Who are you? Hi. Is Sadrith Kegran inhabited solely by Dunmer and their slaves? Indeed. Well, not counting Shaglag, the orc. Don't ask me. I don't know what the deal's with him. Is this your inn? Yes, it is. My mother, Marisa Ferrandas, is the head consul of House Tovani. Politics was never my cup of flint. Disliked plotting and scheming. So I became the owner of this corner club. All oh, right, that's then. fair enough. Go to sleep. Who is threatening and who? Dallas. I would like to give her a piece of jewelry, but Marin did not bring me anything and my father constantly brings daggers. I'm thinking of turning to Varen. Maybe he can forge something unusual. A Rini. No idea what that's about. I want all of this. All of this. I mean, nothing against this dude personally. He seems nice and all, but I'm sure he'll be fine. Uh, the crabs like garlic. They like cheese. Maybe they like grill flakes. Ugh, I know, but I, I, I have nothing to do with them. As much as I love the sight of them, it just doesn't make sense to bring them. Not even imaginary sense, because if I can tell myself I will use them, I want them. But... Mark your enemy for death before they mark you. take all of this and whatever the crabs will actually not want we will throw away mm, gourds potatoes i don't know we have to we have if you to want, I can turn you into a dummy maybe it'll make you stand still for a minute we have to examine their tastes so i don't i don't know what they like so far i know they like alcohol <laughs> who are you hmm. Um, are you the captain of the guard? Are you for the Stormcloaks or the Legion? No, we are not an idiot. I'm not going to ask No, that. I'm the local Morik Tong leader. Any other slackweight questions? Ah, gee, go away. Yeah, yeah. Ugh, Salmon Row, yeah. Gross. And more gross things. Oh no, that's just My a cake. My patience is not endless. I'm not even talking to you. Quiet. I might have to bring back the, the sensible NPC commenting mod, but I don't know if it works on mods. The one that 
makes it so that they only welcome you if they are facing your face in a cone or something like that. Because I have asked everything. Hi! I will give you everything. So you like cabbage, chicken breast, garlic too. I think I think it works actually. You can just give them everything at once. Yeah, we, we got a lot of stuff from this one. Not a lot of money though. What if I give him 13 at once? That's risky, no, I don't want to do that. Or, ah, oh, let's, let's try. Okay, it does work. And we got a lot of, a lot of garbage. Great. There's probably a much easier way. No, my grape juice, damn it. Much easier way to <laughs> acquire gold. And I'm just being an idiot, is that so? I would say that's very possible. Let's see if, if if we do the quest, if she pays us money. I would be surprised if she did. But who knows. How much money do we have? We have 87 gold. Wow, something something must have been expensive for the Krabby. But let's, let's do the quest as, uh, anyway. If the damn orc is even home, he is not. So let's uh, let's go find the Khajiit again. Uh, let let's try to not use the journal for now. Let's try to play it the old way, because I have heard that you can. It's not like regular Skyrim stuff that you basically have to use quest markers to. Find your way because the quest certainly won't help you. What is this place? Yep. All the mana and all the stamina. Alright. If you say so. This 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 does look like the door. And the door out. Um, the council building, right? Unless he left already. And he might have his routine. We are looking for the kitty. Or the orc. Either will do. Is this the council building? Yeah. Kitty kitty, are you here still or have you gone away? Kitty might have gone away. I will never find him. Ugh, I'll never find him. Money. Oh, there's money. Oh, I robbed somebody. Nah, it wasn't. Of course it wasn't the crabs. Of course I just found some coin purse and I did not connect the dots. Because I am, um, I am myself. I am myself, and that should uh, that should suffice for a description here for the explanation. I think it's night, actually. We can't tell because it's underground, but I think it is night. Where's the Kajita? Why is there so many skulls in here? Hi. Oh, um, quick save. Hi. My Lord Hajj, be quiet. I am quiet. Tell me something. Um, but you know what? We can ask you many things. Oh, you heard about the Stone Cold Rebellion. I don't think he cares. Um, whose slave are you? Rajira used to be a slave of Shanat. Horrible time it was. Uh, Rajira really? would not live for long, but Rajira was lucky. Marisa has liked Rajira for some reason. So now Rajira is serving Marisa for long 15 years. So maybe we are not in the best hands around here. Uh, maybe we would prefer to be Marissa's slave. Huh? 
Um, how did you manage to save your tongue? Hey, the senile Shanat forgot to mute Rajira. Rajira would not remind him. Smart. Smart. How's your life going here? Better than most of slaves. I kinda figured. What do you think about this place? Rajira wonders what Sadrit Kegran means. Kegran. Keg? Ran. Running with a keg? <laughs> um, tell me something. Rajira thanks you. Now, listen. Carefully, Rajira gets frightened too. Sometimes from the town, under the town, comes loud noise, loud ramble. Ugh. Azura, save your litter. Tell me about yourself. Both Sarah is here on business, or only wishes to flap the tongue. Can't it be both? I think it could be both. Well, tell me something else. Rajira thanks you. Now, listen carefully. Not all farmers are nice to little Kajit. Some of them black-hearted, ill-tempered and sore-headed. Why on Nurni did Ahnur make them this way? I don't know. Well, you don't seem to You're have anything... You're in hurry? Anything extremely useful to say. Where are you going? Just the gossip, which is fine, but kind of expensive, if you ask me. He was just in a rush to... Oh, to serve her. Oh, so sorry. I... What now? Um, why are you engaged in slave trade? This is a, an amazing question that I've been meaning to ask somebody. Slavery is an integral part of the Dameri culture. We sell endless to Morrowind or overseas. Keeps on to ourselves from time to time. Are you the queen? A queen? No, silly. I'm the consul, which makes me an authorized representative of House Telvani here in Skyrim. And House Telvani is one of the great houses of Morrowind, albeit in decline nowadays. Someday, Sedrith Kegran will become the center of the revival of our greatness. You know what? Listening to those people, I am starting to feel less and less sorry for, for all the Dunmer in Windhelm. I mean, if it's if slavery is a central part of their culture, then their culture may as well perish, and I would not shed a tear. I mean, if one of them was like, no, I, I am for abolishing slavery, I hate it, and by all means, live long and happy life, and I am... I, I will be your great supporter, but... All the rest of them? They can die in a fire. And... Well, the, our master didn't seem bad at first, and... Kind of funny in a way, that made me feel a little bit of sympathy towards him. It might appear that... Oh, they caused the light. Oh, that's so cute. I, I should stop seeing everything as cute. God damn it. I'm a grown-ass woman. Anyway, so the master just... Um, well, it seems like he might be quite an asshole after all. If he wanted... Uh, well, he does have this other slave that he did cut the tongue out of and locked him in a cage. And he, he wanted to cut the tongue out of the Khajiit. So, honestly, I have changed my mind. If somebody was like, you kill him now, I might be like, oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, I want to see what this red thing is. Oh, Vespar. I thought it was a lantern. One more gear and a lesser soul gem. Well, I'll take it. Oh, this is some kind of a robo bug. Are those wings moving? Oh, Vespar, like a VASP thing, right? Right, did I get it? Oh, sorry, it's a WASP, not VASP. <laughs> I, mean, I, I trolled myself by the V here. Okay, may, maybe, maybe I didn't got it. Um, 
Yeah, okay. So this will be it for this episode because I'm getting really sleepy. I, I have been working earlier and I have only found some time to play later, but I kind of wanted to see what's outside. So I will have to be going to sleep now. It's been, it's been a very pointless episode for which I suppose I'm kind of sorry, but also not. Because, I mean, look at this. Look at this place. I... No, you know what? I am not sorry. I am not sorry at all. It was, it was what it was. And in the next episode, perhaps we'll go back to our master and see, see what he would offer us. Maybe we'll find a damn orb and get this shipment from him. And, uh, well, I, I don't suppose we have to feed more stuff to the crabs. We do have some money. Holy fuck, I collected a lot of garbage <laughs> already. Okay, so, uh, yeah, till next time. And it seems like it's going to be quite an adventure and quite different from the regular Skyrim gameplay, which is, which is really nice. It, it kind of it kind of reminds me of, of the Forgotten City, only it's it's a little bit less focused as at the beginning. You have a bit more freedom. It's less about jet I mean it's more about exploration and just talking to random people than solving a mystery per se. And it, yeah, I I didn't know how much Dark Elves from from the Elder Scrolls, Elder Scrolls reminded me of the draws, draws from, from the Dungeons and Dragons, but when I hear about the houses and, and the slavery, all of that, it's like so similar. And now I'm, I'm really inclined to check which ones were first, and I probably will. And yeah, have a, have a, have a wonderful day. I, 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 just one more thing I, I really have to do. Because <laughs> I don't have the mod that fixes them. Okay, and here's another thing I haven't found before. So, until next time. Probably tomorrow. Why is there a skeleton sitting here? It's just a ribcage. Great. Awesome. Um, yeah. Bye-bye. <laughs>